There are many ways how to handle multiple applications at once. Today we will closely look at how to use split view on your Mac. And in addition to that, at the end of the video I will show you the differences between Mission Control and App Exposé. Split view is great in the situations you need to use two apps side by side. Of course you can be resizing the windows to fit nicely on the screen, but it's a bit annoying to do that. Now I have three windows open on the desktop and I want to see just the document and write some notes. Split view is very similar to the full screen, so the controls for it are found under this green button. So move the cursor over the green button and then wait for the menu to appear. And you can use tile window to left of screen or tile window to right of screen. You can also go to window menu on top and select those items there, but I prefer to use this green button. Now once you press it, you will be asked to choose another window to be the right side of the screen. So in this case let's choose notes. We can see our pages document to the left side on the screen and the notes app on the right side of the screen. It looks like a full screen view because it hides dock and menu bar, but what appears extra is this middle line. I can drag that to the right or left to resize the windows. Now how far I can drag it depends on the app. Some apps require exactly half of the screen, other apps can be smaller or larger. Yes, this mode is excellent for being able to work on two separate documents, but I want to exit the split view now. You can do it in two different ways. If you click the green button on this window, it will make this one small and leave the other app in full screen mode. On the other hand, if I want to take both of these out of full screen mode at the same time, I need to use Mission Control. It is this view. You can open up Mission Control by a free finger swipe up gesture on the trackpad or by using the key combination Control App Arrow. Now to get rid of the split view, move cursor over there and click this button. And that takes both of these windows out of split view and back to the desktop that they originally came from. I use split view quite rarely, but what I use all the time is this mission control. I made whole video about it, you can see it on the screen now and the link will be in the description. In that video you will find everything about mission control, so I'll just show you quickly here. Mission control allows you to see all the open windows at the different desktops and organize these apps for easier navigation between them. You will find settings for mission control in system preferences, under trackpad and on the more gestures tab. Here you need to have it ticked on and as I said the gestures free finger swipe up. What you can also see here is app expose. A lot of people is confused about these two different features, but it's actually very simple. Let's stick it on as well and it will be activated by free finger swipe down. So mission control is free finger swipe up and app expose is free finger swipe down. Now the difference is if I swipe up Mission Control will show me all the open applications, all windows and desktops. While App Exposé will show you only windows from the app you are currently using. If I am in Pages now and swipe down with three fingers or use Control down arrow, it will show me open pages documents only and filter of the other apps. As extra, it shows me recently open documents on the button. Now if I click on Finder and swipe down, it will show me only Finder windows. So to summarize it, Split View is great if you work with two windows only. Mission Control helps you navigate between many open apps and allows you to add separate desktops, while App Exposé might be useful only if you are working with many windows of the same app, like few pages documents or Safari windows. I hope now it's all clear and you can take full advantage of these Mac features. And also, Take advantage of more free tutorials and subscribe to Apple Online Academy channel. And in this case, I will see you in the next video.